Welcome to another run here on American Truck Simulator. Um, got a nice little load, so we're gonna get going. So, let's uh, get rolling. But, uh, yeah, uploading the uh, last one here on YouTube. So, we're gonna get, get going. We got a load of square tubing going from Olympia to Coeur d'Alene. Can you drop like here? Shut this off now. And of course we got Anyways, fuck it. Um, got a load of square tubing. Tipping the scales of 49,590 pounds. Going to Coeur d'Alene up to plastic or something. Uh, it's going to take... Six hours, forty-seven minutes. Next rest stop is seven hours and twenty-two minutes. So we should probably get going here. So yeah, we're gonna get rolling. No, oh, for freak's sakes. Well, anyways, hope you guys are doing okay. We got a, ooh, we got a set of doubles here for your livestock out of this, but uh, yeah, hopefully you guys are doing okay. Said so I got the previous video coming uploading to YouTube, and hopefully we'll get this one up there today too, and all that. Well, anyways, yeah, we're gonna get rolling, get trucking here. All that good stuff. And, uh, I kick out the lights here. Probably kick out my windshield wash wipers a little bit here. So, 
Lord. Hope you guys doing okay here today is Saturday, so got got some things to kind of push this morning and uh, and all that earlier this afternoon, so we're pretty much good there um, and all that, so. I uh, finished up uh, party down south there. You know, it was five seasons that show. So yeah, we got that finished up and, and all that. <clears throat> I, don't know, I love that stupid show it was on. Um, yeah, since we got Philo there, it's on the MTV app, so you don't have to pay for nothing and everything's all there for you to watch and all that kind of stuff. So. Oh, and we are speeding like crazy. But yeah, I, <laughs> I certainly do miss that show. Um, it was a damn nice show. Um, all the goofy shit doing to each other and everything else. Can we possibly move our ass here? Holy shit. Yeah, we. <laughs> I honestly do miss that goofy show. It was it was damn good. So I, I uh, <laughs> all the goofy shit they did to each other. Like uh, Walt shaved his chest hair and put the trimmings in a bag of chips, and Maddie ate it and then <laughs> to get him back. <laughs> she shaved Boudreaux's leg leg hair off and put it in his chute. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it was funny as hell. But I just think, you know, it's funny. Walt's just able to get under people's skin and everything, else, especially Lauren's. And in one season, they get there and they get to a huge fucking argument and a fight, whatever the hell. And he was picking on her and she just fucking goes psycho and starts throwing shit everywhere. Fucking. At one point, her titties pop out, and fucking Murray's just like, "Whoa!" <laughs> fucking Murray is the shit too. But it's a good show, and it really kind of sucks that it's they ended it. But
really, uh, I mean, it was just, it was fun to watch. I mean, just, you know, the antics they got into and all that kind of thing. And it was just a fun, enjoyable show to watch. So, like I said, it sucks that they decided uh, that they ended it. And I don't know, it's, you know, it, I suppose for some people it, it got old. But for me, I just thought it was was a really really great show and of course you're gonna pull me into a way station why wouldn't you thousand pounds on this one or not I mean there's still plenty of time in the, in the job to do it we might take a nap when we get there um, but we'll see how things go we got another four hours yet to go so we're probably going to end up taking a nap at some point here because I really don't feel like delivering this at night and then going over my shit to take a rest here before we get into Coeur d'Alene I'm thinking we're probably just going to pull in here because I think by that time we'll probably need fuel so we're just going to go ahead and set that there and if we end up needing the rest before then then that's what we're going to do we're I certainly do miss that watching Party Down South. It was fucking great. I loved it. Um, <coughs> of course, uh, you know, when Maddie got drunk, he used to turn into Martha and cause all kinds of hell. And of course, you had Ryan, or Daddy, used to call everybody that. The first season, they, they all, at the beginning, they pretty much all fucking just like, fuck, oh shit. Just like fucking hated each other, and um, <laughs> yeah. But you know, and then you know, Walt usually wasn't doing too much of the shit. You know, he wasn't usually getting drunk and being an asshole. Um, 
Boudreau, like, the, the beginning, he liked to fucking get drunk and they'd always get kicked out of fucking bars and shit. And, uh, and all that, so... for scenic viewpoints. Well, it's on the other side so I can't really get to it right now anyway, so never mind. I, <laughs> I definitely, definitely enjoyed the shit on that show, and it was, uh, yeah, it was, it was pretty good, and it's just, it's stupid reality television, but I still thought it was pretty great, and, uh, you know, like, Murray never really caused too much problems, the old flounder pounder there, and like I said, uh, him, and Walt, Mr. September there, they never really caused too much issues, but they're pretty much the ones bringing the most, uh, most action home. Uh, I can't remember. I think it was second to last season? Freaking Walt, I think, ended up hooking up with, like, I don't know, at least a dozen different chicks. It was pretty crazy, but, um, yeah. But, you know, it was, it was, like I said, it was a good show, and, um, <laughs> Tiffany was just loud mouth from the start, I mean, that's just how it is, and then Owen Boudreau and that Santana chick were together, and she cheated on him, and, and stuff like that, and Tiffany found out about it, and she freaking just calls Santana on the phone and calls her an old cheat and whore and everything else. <laughs> Stop lying, you cheating bitch! <laughs> oh man. But yeah, I, I I've been thinking about watching starting Florida Bama Shore or Florida Bama Shore, whatever the hell it is. It's supposed to be similar, but I don't know. We'll see. I might try watching that show and see what that's all about, but. I guess we'll see. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be a party down south type thing. Um, and party down south two was pretty decent, but that was only on three seasons, and I kind of went to the same places that the original went from the original did. So that was kind of cool. Um, just different crews doing you know the same spots. So it was kind of neat to see that part of it and to see you know different things that they did and you know one group did one thing and another group, the other group did the other so it was you know but yeah it was definitely a good show and I was sad when it ended um, man, there wasn't any ugly chicks on that show, neither. Neither one, there wasn't any ugly chicks on there. Um, except for maybe, uh, some of the chicks the old Flounder Pounder brought home there. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it was funny. Um, but yeah, I... <laughs> I always thought it was a pretty damn good show. But like I said, I don't know. I'm going to try to watch Floor Bama Shore and see if that's similar. Uh, I've heard it is, but uh, I don't know. We'll see. And um, 
and see what goes on there, I guess. Yeah, I know you're getting tired. Drink a monster and let's get rolling here. We'll roll down the windows for you. Me there, Buster. Jesus Christ. Fucking goddamn mail truck almost took me out. Son of a bitch. Bullshit is this? Slow traffic ahead. Well, I've been passing slow traffic, so there shouldn't be too much issue there. <laughs> been leaving them in the dust. But yeah, we're gonna. I'm hopefully gonna be starting to watch that. Florabama shore and we'll see how things go I mean it if it's dumb I'm not gonna keep watching it but if it's not bad oh so you passed me like I was standing still just a fucking just to drive like a dumb slow asshole okay cool I see we got the idiots out driving around. CPs here pretty shortly, and I need to get fuel, so figure might as well stop at the old truck stop there. Yeah, I know, I ran, ran a red line. So... Let me stop and get our fuel here, please.
they're all parking like dum dums here. And it's raining again. Perfect. I swear to God, it's fucking raining all the time. In the game. And I really haven't fucked with the rain much, but, uh. Well, we should be there pretty soon, so... Yeah, I just don't feel like making the delivery and then end up going over hours. And then they tax your ass like every five minutes until you pull over. So it's like, Jesus. destination here in another little bit so we'll be good to go Gotta be that close to me. Right here. <laughs> Griswold thing, the truck's there behind us. Oof, some shit might happen this episode. <laughs> might happen yet. <laughs>
cop no stop. Well, there was, but he was heading the other way, so fuck him. <laughs> Must be building a big ass uh, warehouse or something here. See how much pain in the ass this is gonna be. Yeah, it looks like they're building a pretty good sized shop or something here. I guess it's shop. It's this big door here. And a couple, few good sized ones on the other side. Shop, dealership maybe. Who knows? But, we'll see. Guess we'll see what they, uh, what the building is for. Anyways, that's gonna go ahead and wrap it up for Brown here. So, yeah, till the till the next episode of either Farm Simulator or American Truck Simulator, either one. Uh, <laughs> anyways, until then, take her easy and all that good stuff.